Hi everyone, my name is Lai Jun Hun Zeng. I'm 13 years old and come from Wing Chat Secondary Schools. In today's videos, I would like to introduce you to some of my ideas for building the future of Longsing City as green, clean, stunning and civilized city. Now, let's explore how we can transform our city into the place that we can take a greater bright end. Let's dive in! After 24 years of establishment and continuous development, Longsing City has been changing in many different ways. There have been many projects forming functional areas, such as West of Pao New Urban Area, Sport Area, Provincial Administrative Area. In addition, the scheme on upgrading suburban transport systems implemented by the government as well as the citizens have facilitated people in circulating and transporting goods and planting more trees to make our city green. However, besides both mentions achievements, there are still some problems that need to be solved. For instance, the canals of Red Gorbe, Tambo are full of the garbage and dirty water. The collection of waste hasn't been carried out scientifically, leading to a lot of waste bins on the roads and it makes our city become aesthetically unappealing. And at the same time, the lack of trees along the important routes such as Jung Hung Dao, Bam Lung, etc. need to be taken into consideration. So how can we improve the quality of life in Hong Sing City? First, let's discuss about making our city green. A green city starts with planting trees, establishing community gardens, and encouraging sustainable practices. By doing so, we not only improve the air quality, reduce the heat island effect, but also provide natural habitats and green spaces. For instance, Mithai Park or the area of Nguyen Yu Lake in Mibin World. Now, let's shift our focus to keeping our city clean. A responsibility we all share through responsible waste management and sourcing, recycling programs, and organizing regular clean-up campaigns. From these actions, the picture of clean streets, little free parks, and well-maintained public spaces is painted of a city we can rejoice in. Currently, a range of videos shared online showing young volunteers picking up trash around the city especially in canals and rivers that are filled with garbage. These are commendable activities. Sunning City captures the hearts of residents and visitors alike. The significant tasks now are understanding the power grids and cables, which can contribute to improving urban beauty. At the same time, ensuring safety for citizens and allow the tree to grow high for shade. Essentially, public transport with better service quality has to be increased. Using public transport, especially electric buses, more frequently results in a cleaner and more beautiful Lumsden city. It is also helpful in reducing air pollution and traffic congestion. Besides, by investing in urban design, reserving historical landmarks, and promoting public art installations, we create a visually captivating environment. It not only enhances our city of Peru, but it also boosts tourism and economic growth. Finally, let's discuss building a civilized city. It's about fostering respect and harmony among our community. And we can achieve this by promoting cultural diversity or encouraging civic participation, as well as organizing events that bring people together. Education, empathy, and good governance played a vital role in shaping civilized cities. In conclusion, making our city green, clean, stunning, and civilized is a shared responsibility. Together, let's plan the speed of change, enhance our surroundings, and nurture a sense of community. By working hand in hand, our Longsing city can be converted into a place that we all aspire to live in.